Hi, my name is Josephine and I'm here to show you how to create a top knot. Today my look is inspired by amazing actress Jennifer Lawrence. So to start off with I've washed and conditioned my hair and afterwards I blow dried it. And because I'm doing a top knot, the trick for me that I find really helpful is to just turn my head upside down and literally just blow dry it like this just to make sure that all those little really random bits get completely neat and nice. So anyway, here I am. And let's start off by finding the correct point to put my ponytail. So I'm gonna turn my head upside down once again. Because the main thing is to find the perfect place for the ponytail and make sure all the little hair is completely neat. If you don't start off in this way, um, the whole work is just a bit wasted because you're gonna have to redo it. So just gonna take a little bit of time doing this, but just stick with me guys. So it's really good to start off using um, the bigger brush just to make sure you've got all the hairs collected but then once you've, you're kind of there you can always swap brushes and go more for like a tail comb with tiny bristles here. I'm using two elastics just to make sure once again that it's absolutely secure because that's guys we just have to redo it one more time. One last time. You can always use the brush one more time to go around. That's, that was a little bump there, but just brushed it back now. Go. So to create a top knot as opposed to a top bun, which is a slightly more relaxed look, I'm actually going to divide the hair into two sections. I'm going to back comb it a little bit. So first I'm going to smooth it on the one side, then I'm just going to back comb it, going all the way from the top all the way down, making it nice and fluffy, very texturized. Go, that's one side. The other side. To get a good hold here at the top and then just start making your way down like this. Here we go. Grabbing hold of that one section. Let's just smooth it out a little bit on the front on the top side. Scoop it onto the other front. Take it to the front again. Okay. And twisting the other one to the back. Let's take it. Front. Just making sure that it looks nice and smooth at the front. That's sort of the main thing. So we want it to look nice and and relaxed, but not completely knotted up. So got a nice neat front bit. Take your ends, just enter them here at the bottom. You want to make sure you secure them here at the, the top of your crown, as opposed to just sort of sticking them randomly at the top, because then they're not going to hold. If you secure them by literally sticking in hold and just move along the crown of the head then they'll be in a secure place and you'll make sure that your top knot stays in place the whole of the night not just for the first hour or two. I'm not seeing maybe just going over a few sprays of hairspray. Once again you can always use that little brush again making sure everything is looking neat because you want to achieve that perfect balance between you know super messy top knot and, and classy night out so hopefully yeah I think that's about it. Hope you enjoyed it.